Welcome back, Achievers, to Little Nightmares 2. It's been a while since I've been able to do this, so I'm really excited to be back and just jump right in. So we're in pale in the Pale City. We're figuring out what's going on. I remember that. Okay. Honestly, the TV show sounds like it's a good show. <gasps> Fuck! <gasps> the fuck was up with his face? Um, no thank you. That genuinely scared me. The music is suddenly not quite so cheery anymore. Yay! Okay. Face first into the TV. I mean, that's a fat mood. Hey, look, it's the teacher and the cranium kids and the paintings back here. I, I, I seem to remember the teacher having her painting on the maw in the first game. I might have to revisit and check it out, but I have no idea who the hell this is. But those look like cranium kids in the middle. Um, hello sir. Please don't come back to life. Out the window we go. You know, Six, I'm really glad that we got you a coat. Because it's kind of cold and it's kind of super wet, so... Six, you're slow. Keep up. Shh. Gotta be sneaky. Gotta be real fucking sneaky. Oh my god. Why are they so obsessed with the TVs? Also, what is that scraping sound? It sounds like an alien or some shit. It's kind of a an exciting song. Reminds me of the songs that play like with the the coin sheet, like you stick the quarters in the machine and then you, you get the chance of getting more quarters. That's what that song reminds me of. Maybe that's what they're watching. This is why God invented flat screen TVs instead of continuing to use the box TVs. Jesus. Oh! I got surprised. That's the song! Oh my god, there we go. To remember the controls, it's been a minute. Excuse me, sir, but that's recipe for death. To be fair. If I could watch TV while I was in the tub, I would. Not gonna lie. That's a song that plays with the, um... That's the kind of program I'd listen to. No, the previous song was was on the Maw. I remember that. And it was in the schoolhouse too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it was in the schoolhouse, for sure it was. Alright, let's see what's up coming next. Hope it's not death. Um, it could be if I... Okie dokie, we're apparently dying. Six just kind of startled me. They took the lead. It's just a small nightmare. Just a little one. What button is it to run? Let's go. It's this one, isn't it? Let's go! Say Geronimo. Say Geronimo. Where to next? Do we have to go in? Ooh. Okay, um, I guess we're going down. We're going up. Awesome. I could fit through that. Look, see, his little noggin fits. Just take off the paper bag. Really, the game's gonna really do this to me, isn't it? Aren't they? That's annoying. Um, cool. Let's figure this one out, I guess. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I think I know what I need to do. Let's try going up again. There's another opening this way. Okay. Bye, Six. I thought you were going to follow, but I guess not. I think this is where I'm supposed to go. And if not, then I'm royally fucked. Oh my god, this game's so beautiful. Look at this little boy. All the 
dust particles. Hopefully you don't have allergies to anything. What's in the air? I feel like that would really suck. You know what would really suck in this world? Is if you're like me and you're blind and have to wear glasses. That would really suck. Because then if your glasses broke, you're just fucked. You would just die. Okay, now we gotta figure out a way to get six out and apparently get up there because that's what the camera's telling me to do. Alrighty then. Um. Hmm. There's gotta be something over here. Oh, there's a little gnome. Someone drew a gnome right here. Hello, gnome. That looks like an ultrasound. And that looks like a really long to-do list that didn't get done. Um, okay, we're looking for a key. Maybe it's in the drawers? That one didn't come out any further. Hey, look at me go! I still got the touch. Pick up the key. Pick, pick up, pick up, pick, pick up the key. There we go. And we're gonna unlock it. Hi, Six, we're reunited, and it feels so good. Hi. I missed you. Okay. Cool. That did nothing. Okay, um... What am I even supposed to fucking do? Can you pan out again? Camera? I would like to see... They're not gonna do that. That's that's not how this works. Um, six isn't coming apparently, so I'm gonna stick with her. Big brain, I got this. Okay, come on, six, let's try this again. Really relying on six because they seem to really know what they're doing right now. Yep. Cool. We made it. We made it. We made it. Made it. Let's go. Grabbing things is great! There we go. Ooh. We're outside again on a roof. That's pretty spooky. That's really spooky. Um, is this like a post-industrial Middle Earth? Is that what this is? Hello, Sauron. I am not a hobbit. I do not have the ring. It's not the droids you're looking for. <laughs> okay, well... Is that window open? Can it go in there? Is that where I'm supposed to go? <gasps> Hi, glitchy kid. Why are there bats in cages? Is that a monkey? There's rats. Looks like a monkey. Interesting. That's fucking weird. I guess that's not where I'm supposed to go, though. Um. Oh, up. I understand now. Uppy Daisy. Hmm. Are we supposed to like Robin Hood this shit? Let's do it. Boost me. Thanks, Six. I really hope this hangar is strong enough for you to go. Go across. Ready? This direction. We are Robin Hooding, Robin Hooding it. How am I supposed to get across though? Gotcha. Cool. And jump! I am so glad you are strong, Six, because that would be really bad. That would be really sad if they weren't. I guess we should start climbing up. Oop, there we go. The city is immense. Is the best word I can come up for with it. Um, come up with for it. Words are hard. And I love the background art 
The background is, is just fantastic. It's phenomenal. Just... This game is just so pretty. I love it. So fucking cool. Um, climb pipe. Climb pipe. Let's go. Let's do it. Okay. I'm just fascinated at looking at looking at the background is what I'm doing. Sauron's eye menacingly there. This sounds spooky. It looks and feels like the buildings are like breathing. It's gonna fall apart, isn't it? Ooh, this is bad news. I'm a little concerned. I'm... Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. I'm very concerned. Oh no. Run. Help me. Six. Push. Push. It's falling apart. What? We chose the wrong building. This is a very wrong building to choose. I don't appreciate all of this in my ears. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Six. Oh. That was supposed to happen, okay. Oh no, six. Oh no, six. Oh no, my flashlight. Oh, this is all very bad news. Are you okay, six? Is your tiny child body crushed? Can I help you out? Please don't be, like, crushed to death. We have no child wheelchairs to help you. Okay, your legs function. That's good. okay? That was traumatic. I can hold your hand for a minute. Hand hug. You okay? I would not be okay if I were six. My flashlight's dead. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that's nerve-wracking. I'm not prepared to not have a flashlight. Um, okay. Why is the music so suspenseful? I like the dude's hat. Why are there so many eyes drawn under the bed? Huh. Okay, well. I'm, I feel very... I feel like this is all very sus right now. That's a shoe. I thought that was something else. Oh, of course. Not looking forward to this. Let's go touch the TV and feel the tinglies in our hand. And... TV time. There's one. And... Two. And uh, three. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. There it is. I found the sweet spot. Okay. And say Geronimo. Geronimo. Say Geronimo. Um, six isn't gonna pull me up. Okay, that door handle's really low for what normal doors are. Oh, I don't think I should. This is, this is gonna end badly. This is gonna end badly. Uh oh, I'm not, I'm not ready. Um, it's not, no, that's not okay. Uh, 
fuck. Oh, fuck. He's coming. That is Slender Man's older business cousin. That's who that is. Ooh, this is not okay. Oh, no. Fuck no. Run. Why are you not running? I'm pushing the buttons to run. Run fast, kid. Run fast, kid. Holy fucking shit. Is this not okay? This is not okay. Come on, six. Six, run, 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 run. Fuck, he's tall. No, Slendy, no. Six, why are you hiding there? Six, six, six. Glitch children are just children he's kidnapped? Oh, this is bad news bears. I'm gonna hide for just a minute. Um. What? That's a lot of information to digest right there. Um, cool. I don't know how to feel about it. I can understand why all of the drawings are on the bed now, or under the bed. I would be doing the same. I would not leave. I would just draw eyeballs. I understand everything now. Um, so Slenderman's cousin. Cool. Business cousin. Got it. Kidnapping children and leaving glitched children behind. Great. Static kids. Oh fuck, is he still? Okay, um, I'm guessing I should follow? I- every- everything in me is telling me not to follow right now. Oh, I don't want to. What the fuck? Is this what it's like to do acid? Thank god for the conveniently placed squished mattress. Okay, um, wow. Hmm. What the fuck? That's all I can say. What the actual fuck? Now what am I supposed to do? I have no buddy. I have no buddy to catch me if I'm falling. Okay, um, this is bad news bears right here. That's what that is. Okay, how do I get up? Oh, like that, apparently. Cool. Get it now. I was kind of hoping to see the scene again. I saw an eyeball. Look at me. That was disturbing. I kind of wanted to watch it again just to see if I could see more. Thank God for rubber. Oh, I didn't even actually need it. Cool. Honestly, this is a really convenient superpower to have to travel between TVs. You know, it's really disappointing when you put laundry out to dry like this and it's just downpour. I feel like that's not how it's supposed to work. I don't trust that board. Never mind, I do trust it. gonna do some parkour. Hardcore parkour! Jeez Louise. Oh my god. I don't even know how I'm gonna rescue Six. I wouldn't even know how to get them away from Slenderman's cousin. Like, hearing so many TVs. How are they even getting powers? They're like, don't trust the board. 
Like, how, how are the power plants still functioning? Is there, like, a monster connected to the power plants? Okay, I think I need to use the other TV. How do I turn it on, though? Some pretty pog music, though. TV remote. I have unlocked everything. I need nothing else but TV remote. I understand everything. <laughs> Maybe this is why my nephew always wants the TV remote and is never ready to relinquish it. Some fucking garbled speech. Um, where am I supposed to go? Down there or across? I could just watch the TV for a minute. I like- I like that music, I, genuinely. It's fun. Who's whistling? I don't like it in the lower key. Okay, I see what I gotta do. Let's pull this out. Let's turn on the TV, hop through, and then I can jump across with this thing. Theoretically speaking, of course. Let's give that a shot. all those letters say and why there isn't like a letter monster I don't know there's so many unanswered questions in this game it's just like I just want to know how it all started what was the catalyst to cause all of this Sneaky. Hello, Grandma. Um, I worry that if I were to turn off the TV, she'd fuck me up. So we'll let her watch TV and just quietly sneak past. Don't notice me, please. Thanks, Grandma. Just keep watching your soaps. Is there anything in the fridge I can take? trust anything in that fridge anyway. Is this where she... Kind of like this program. I feel like that's where she cooks and eats children. Oh, I understand. Okay, let's turn that one on then. And hopefully she'll just run straight to that one and then I can use it to teleport out. I'm assuming that's what the case is. Okay, if I just hide here, turn off. Don't notice me, don't notice me, don't notice me. What's wrong? What's wrong? What? What, do you, what is your face? What the fuck? Is that why my mom always told me not to watch too much TV? Is this just a social commentary as to like how addicted we are to TV and to like our shows and stuff? I, maybe that's what the whole thing is about. I want to see her face. The fuck is wrong with her? Let's see. I just. I don't want my face to cave in like that. Maybe I should cut back on my TV time. <laughs> what the actual fuck? Okay. I just. So many unanswered questions. 
I'm gonna have to watch a bunch of theory videos after this. Yikes. There's a dude up there. Cool. Um, oops. Will he look at that TV? I don't feel like he'd be able to bridge that gap, but maybe if he just stares at it? So that's why bodies were hitting the floor. Ooh, okie dokie. That's kind of fucked. He's just yeet himself off the building. <laughs> Whoa, let's not fall. Get up, kid. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Good job. I was late pushing that button. That's so much of this is just so disturbing. I just don't even know how to process it all. Don't understand. I genuinely don't. I feel like there's got to be some sort of correlation between this and the guests on the mall. I don't see like piles of food next to them though, so I don't feel like they'd be gaining weight to go to the mall. Oh great! Okay. The only thing going through my head right now is on, on a bug's life. When the moths are going to the when the bugs are going to the light and they're like, I can't help it. It's so beautiful. It's the only thing that's going through my head right now. What the fuck? Can I stop you guys from jumping? I mean they're not really jumping, they're just yeeting. There's three more. Oh, two more. I just... I don't understand. Okay, well, let's move on and keep going, I guess. I really hope I don't run into Slenderman's cousin anytime soon. Oh, fuck. Um, I just kind of went for it, didn't I? <laughs> Let's fix that. Um, what should I do to not be spat forth over the ledge? What happens if I push it? I get spat forth into the window. Okie dokie, I can do that. wonder what the pitch meeting was for the sounds of the TV. Like, how did they come up with generic TV sounds? That's the sound of one of the guys. The scrapey sound is their, their voices. He wants to come in. What does this do? I understand. I don't fucking want to do that. I don't want to fucking do that. I don't want to do anything. Butter do, butter do. He's just, he's just going berserk. Okay, kid. Run. Die. Perish. His haircut is unfortunate. Oh, I just killed something. I'm rather uncomfy about that. Excuse me, sir. Um, I'm sorry about your untimely demise. I don't think there's anything else here. I'm not hearing like their weird scrapey sounds or anything like that. Ew. Is this a trash chute? Oh, gross. Ew. L. That's disgusting. Why is there an eyeball over here? Huh. 
That's fucking weird. So many packages. I wonder what's in all of them. Oh, there's another gnome drawn. It was on the package there. Okay, well. Let's open that up and figure out what to do here. Let's make the TV, the thing go up and see what happens. Am I going up? I don't even know what I'm supposed to do, honestly. Got you. Okie dokie. Let's do that then. Okay, I understand now. I understand completely. I understand everything. I keep saying that when I'm genuinely like, I don't. I don't understand a single thing in this game. Nothing at all. I might have to revisit the first game after playing this one. Just to... I don't know, see if I can glean more information from the first game to understand this one better. What I really should do is play the mobile game. I have it. I've played like maybe five minutes of it. Go through. Oh, it's gonna be too late. It's gonna be too late. And top. Perfect. I did it. But yeah, I should really play the phone game more because I feel like there'd be more information in the phone game. I don't think I can go that way. Please, no tall man. Why are these toys so unsettling looking? I don't like it. Please don't come alive and kill me. Dear toy. I know this isn't Five Nights at Freddy's, but... Um... Let's not touch that water. Excuse me, ma'am, I need your stool. For that door. I really don't want to try and trigger her. Okie dokie. Um, so I can't- I need the stool, but I can't get close to her because I don't want to trigger her. How do I kill? Electrocution. Electrocution. That's how I kill. Okie dokie. Um, do I have to? Can I pull the armchair? I cannot pull the armchair. She's way too into her, her show. Let's, let's just... Give it a shot. Caution to the wind. I did not like that. I do not like that Sam I am. I would not do it in a train and I would not do it on a plane. Neither with a fox. Alright, well, let's get the fucking stool. Okay, well, let's do... Let's do it to it. Shh. I kind of want to see, but I kind of don't at the same time. It's also really disturbing imagery right here with the shadows, like the silhouettes of them. Just twitching. Standing there, twitching, twitching. I just want to know what drugs they took to make this all, you know, the world that they were in. Huh. What is the significance of the pissing dog? I found him in the piss closet. There has to be something to it. Like, it can't, like... 
I feel like there's so much meaning in this game behind all of the little things that isn't just that just isn't explained. Or alternatively, I could just be reading way into it. Um cool. I can maybe use a shopping cart. Let's give that a shot. Hey, all four wheels turn. Thanks for going into like the perfect spot. I'm pretty sure that was programmed, but if it was not and it was accidental, that's pretty, pretty cool. I hate the stuff. I hate the stuffed animals. They're way too fucking disturbing. Please don't come alive and eat me. Freddy, Freddy fucking Fazbear. That's what it reminds me of. Maybe just because it's another horror game. That might be it. Oh, okay. I can turn off the electricity. But I fear... Turn off the electricity, thank you. Fear in doing so would cause the TV to turn off too. And I kind of need that on. Oh, I get it. Okay, I can push the car shopping cart over there. Full cart, full carts. Okay, I think that's good. Okie dokie. I see what I gotta do. So, we gotta turn the power back on. And then jump to the platforms above the water so I don't get electrocuted. I don't remember that ball being there. Was that ball there before? I might just not be observant. Hopefully that's the case and it's not some secret spooky ball. Alright. Let's turn it on. Yay! Let's see if my theory works. Didn't. Let's try that again. I'm blaming the ball. It's a spooky ball. Threw me off my groove. Fuck! Can I do all that again? That's really fucking obnoxious. Maybe I can position it better this time. Alright, attempt number two. Way? It's too dark over in that corner. I don't think there's anything over there. Yeah, it's this way. Um, no thanks? I don't like the look of it. I don't like the look of this. I'm not a fan. Okay, let's go turn this on. Do what we've done before. Shh. Don't notice me, don't notice me, don't notice me. Don't notice me, don't notice me, don't notice me. Thank you. Uh-oh. 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 Fuck. 
fuck, I broke it. Now they're pissed. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Just going, just running. Run! Run, 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 run! Dear TVs, please distract them momentarily while I run away. Ooh, this is getting the adrenaline pump in. I am not a fan. I do not like, do not want. No, why aren't you running, kid? Fucking wall. Okay. Did I make it? I made it. That was not okay. That was not a fan. Oh, I think we're gonna run into Mr. Mr. Cousin Slenderman, businessman boy. Mm-hmm. I feel like that's what's next on the agenda, and I'm not sure if I'm ready for it. This is scary. Probably should have cut this episode in half, but I didn't, so... Uh-oh. Okay, so I immediately... The axe and door. Okay. That's the way out if things go south. I don't want to... Oh fuck, it's six. Of course I'm gonna go help six though. Come on, six. Let me help you. I'll pull you out. I'll pull you out, I promise. I got you. Fuck me. Sideways, please. I gotta go get my axe and escape. Come on. I need the axe somehow. One. Okay, I gotta get three strikes. Two. Fuck. Three. Run away. Run away! No, 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 no! I do not like this at all! I sure fucking don't! Oh god. This is not okay. This kind of fucking scary right now. I'm not doing so hot. Fuck. He's literally right above me. Can we not? Can we fucking not? He gonna, he's gonna look. I feel like he's smarter than the other enemies I've encountered, and I'm not- I'm not here for it. What did I fucking say? What did I fucking say? He's taking a peek! Please leave. Please leave. Is he still fucking there? I mean, what's the worst that'll happen is I die, right? Okay. Good. He's not fucking right there anymore. <laughs> I hate- I hate it. I hate all of this. I didn't want a chase scene today. Oh my fucking god. Uh oh. Alright, he's gonna come down that hallway. I see it coming. That hallway's twisted. Like the one before. <laughs> I need to leave. I need to escape. Why does like- Why does shit- Don't glitch, bitch. Fuck off. Why does- things slow down when he's here? That's my question. Oh no, this is bad. Oh fuck, this is death happening. Okay. Oh, my heart is racing so fast. This is not fun. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm having fun. But this is scary. And sometimes scary is not fun. And my hands are a little bit sweaty. He's gonna be on the train. I fucking told you I wouldn't on a train. Nor on a plane. Did I predict the fucking future? Maybe. Please don't glitch. Bitch, I told you to not fucking glitch. Fuck off. Run faster. Run faster! I can't be too loud! For it is the night! Oh, 
The music is so good. But why does it gotta be like that? I see, I see, and I obey, and I do things. Bye, bitch. God, fuck you, fuck you. I hate him. I don't. I don't like Slenderman's cousin. I did not anticipate meeting him today, and I don't want to meet any of the rest of his family. Oh, this is bad. I'm gonna crash. Ow. Fuck, that hurts. Ugh. Ow. Is he dead? I mean, that would be an untimely demise. I feel like every horror game has to have some sort of train. Or a hospital. I feel like this one's knocking, like, ticking off all the boxes for a good horror game. Oh, six. Oh, I'm fucking limping. I'm a gimpy. I'm a gimpy boy. This is me in the mornings before I had my hip surgery. <laughs> I mean, it was bad at one at some points. So I couldn't like walk up the stairs. It kind of sucked. Six, you're being playful. I'm fixed now, though. Don't worry. I'm coming, Six. I will save you, I promise. This reminds me a lot of the ending of the first game with her walking up the steps. Um, after defeating the lady to exit the maw. Interesting. Mmm, don't like that sound. That's fucking weird. Buildings are moving. He's coming, isn't he? Yep. Oh my god, this is where I die, I guess. This can't be the ending of the game. Is this the ending? Why are you removing your bag? Oh no! Mono! Your face protector! Hold up. What? Wait, what? What? Me tuning into the TVs was practice all along! Okay. What am I supposed to do? Follow his hand. Gotcha. I got this. I got this. Eat shit, bitch! Rule of three? Please? How am I more powerful than him? Is he my dad? Trippy. One more? No mess? Or is he dead? I think he's dead. The fuck? I have his superpowers. Is that future me? Am I like in a weird time loop paradox? Is that what this is all about? I can't walk forward, but maybe I can teleport? Is that what's going on? I'm literally bending. 
the rules of reality right here. That's fucking trippy. Alright, well I'm gonna leave this episode here. I feel like we're entering the finale of the game, so we'll just stop right here and thanks for joining me today and I hope to see you next time. Bye!